just when you think things are getting better, they're not. <laughs> What's up, YouTube family? Gerald Greenlee here with Cleaning Green Lawn Service in beautiful South Georgia. And man, it is a beautiful day today out. Um, 68 degrees at 728 in the morning. <laughs> You know what that means? The grass is slowing down. Matter of fact, we had uh, had a lady send me a message last night. She said, I'm sorry to text you so late, but my grass just doesn't need it. And we said, hallelujah. <laughs> uh, I said, ain't no problem. We'll see you next week. So... Our weeklies are, are, are pretty well going to bi-weekly now. Um, you know, we'll... Uh, in fact, we, I had a, I had a bi-week. I've, I've moved a couple of bi-weeklies to three weeks now. I called them yesterday, and they just said, Nah, it ain't growing, you know. And uh, y'all know, man, we get to this time of the year. I don't mind pushing them back. <laughs> Uh, and this is going, uh, well, you know, if everything goes according to the plan, it's basically my last month of cut. Um, like I'm cutting now, so, uh, still going to keep some, but going to slow it down a bunch, man, slow it down a bunch. And I'll probably do a video on, you know, um, what it was like, you know, just kind of a, uh, you know, just something where I can get on here and ramble, because <laughs> I do something different normally, you know. No, but really just looking at at, at full time, you know, uh, what I expected versus how it was, uh, which really wasn't much different. Um, but I will say this, uh, it's a lot more fun, it's a lot more fun to cut a day a week, okay? Um, it is. Uh, and like I said in a previous video, I mean, I, I really didn't intend to do this as a business, uh, like a full-time business. I, uh, you know, just made the decisions I did, and I needed something to make money for a while, so... <laughs> That's what I did, you know. I want them kind of people. I don't care if I got to. I don't care if I got to empty out, you know, sewage tanks with a shovel. You know, if, that, if that's the only way I can make money. I believe if you able, you need a job, right? Be sitting, sitting around waiting on somebody to give you something. Not me. One of my little frogs from the house, man. Now he should have stayed at the house. Tell where you gonna end up at? It looked like Egypt and the fro the plague of the frogs at my house after all that rain. So, anyway, the guys are out cutting. I'm headed out. No way we're gonna get done what we need to do today. We had uh, 30 properties on the schedule for yesterday and today. We got five of them done yesterday. So there's 25 on today. And my first one's about three acres. <laughs> so, I uh, sent Elro a message to see if he wanted to work today. But I didn't message him until late last night. And uh, anyway, I, I figured when he got up out of his recliner to go get in the bed, he'd see the message. But apparently he didn't. So, but he'll call, he'll call me later. And uh, if I need him to, he'll come meet me. I was just going to get to see if he wanted to help me cut these couple of big ones. Uh, small ones ain't really nothing to them. I mean, it still, it still makes it faster. But anyway, let's get to work. Oh, look at that, man. Huh? Got the big boss back today. Things getting done today. The other guys messaging, what can we do? <laughs> They're worried about their jobs. <laughs> their temporary jobs. <laughs> uh, yeah, man, we 
out. We done did, uh, let's see, one, and about, about five. Yeah. Like yeah. We did the bank when you came, and then we did the three in the other one. Yeah. So oh, I can't, what's your name, Mr. Wright? Is oh, you? oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Well, it is two yards. Unfortunately, I only charge it for one, but it's two. <laughs> uh, we going we got about three more to do, and the guy's got three more to do. Well, it's really four. I can't see. I kind of try to park in Crandall as one property because I do them together, but I build them separate. <laughs> So they're going to knock them out. So they got one big one and two small ones. And we got three decent sizes. Two of them a little over an acre and one of them, I don't think that, I think about two. Yeah, two of them over an acre. And then shirt trying is probably, little, probably two and a quarter acre or something like that. Yeah. But it ain't bad to cut. So. It's also two houses. Well, it is two houses, yeah. The Elro count them houses, man. I need to let him do the billing. <laughs> Be making some money then. <laughs> uh, yep, getting it done. Just when you think things are getting better, they're not. <laughs> uh, so we cut, we got everything cut today. Everything. Now we had a couple of people, uh, one, the yard was too wet. We had one that had the car park where we couldn't access the gate. So they know it's supposed to be moved and it was in the way, so we didn't do it. And then we had one that canceled today. Um, and you know, it's a weekly and the grass is just not growing. Um, so we got everything else done, I hope, supposedly. I need to verify with the guys that they got, I mean, they back at the shop, so <laughs> hopefully they got everything done. Um, Cause we swapped up some of what they were doing and what we were doing. Um, so anyway, um, so I get a call a while ago from one of the customers today and uh, she says, hey, I got a flower pot in the backyard. You guys hit it and broke it. What we gonna do about it? I said, throw it in the trash. I don't know what you gonna do. <laughs> no. I said, well, I mean, if we broke it, we'll make it right. I said, you know, do you know where you got it from? Or, And she said, I think I got it in Sarasota, Florida. I was thinking, well, we're not going to Sarasota to get one. I said, well, is, do you have two matching ones or is it just one? What is it? Oh, it's just one. I said, well, can I get you something that's similar to it? You know? Oh, yeah, yeah, that'd be fine. I said, okay. So, the husband's supposed to send me some pictures. Um, and so, now, did we do it? I don't know. She said it was bumped last time and slid over a little bit, and then this time it was busted. Um, like crumbled is what she said. So, I don't know how I'm going to get a picture of it if it's crumbled. Or if by crumble, she just means it's cracked all over now, you know. Um, so I got I got to do some more investigation. Now, one of the things I'm gonna do once I get the pictures is I'll send the guys a message, find out who did that, you know, who did that area, and then we'll go from there, um, you know. So anyway. That's, that's just the way it is. Y'all know. I mean, could have been a broke window, a dented car. Could have been a lot worse. But if, in fact, they did it, and if it's something that I look at and go, you had to know you did it, now that's where I get aggravated. We broke water lines, and we've hit stuff, and chopped up people's I mean, we've, we've damaged stuff before, but what, what guys do is they say, hey, they'll call me, or if I'm with them, they'll call me over there and show me. I take a picture of it. If the customer ain't there, I send them a message. Uh, because what you don't ever want is a customer to call you 
and say you damaged something. You want to be, because then you're on defense. You want to be on offense and say, hey, we bumped into this thing. We messed it up. Uh, you know, we'll get you another one. We'll pay you what it's worth. You know, whatever, right? Um, so, now, you know, that, that's, just a, that's just the way things need to be done. Uh, so, so I only say that, say that it's part of the business, yes, but it's part of that aggravation, right? That, that when, when you're not doing things yourself, that's some of what you get into. You know, when 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 you uh, when you run solo, or even you run and somebody's with you, I mean, they can still do something and not tell you. But like, especially that's a small yard. You know, I usually try to do a once round when we get done, just make sure everything's done. I probably would have seen it. Maybe. I mean, again, I, I don't know what it looks like, so. Uh, there's a chance I would have seen it. Let me put it that way. So, anyway, um, you know, just something you got to deal with. So, at least it wasn't some kind of antique that her grandmother gave her. <laughs> uh, you know, like stuff you can't replace. Anyway, we'll see what's going on. But she was happy. She said, okay, that's fine. I appreciate it. You know? And I don't, th I don't think... I mean, they seem like very reasonable people. I, you know, I don't know them. They're some of my newest customers. But, you know, I, I don't think they would... I don't have any reason to believe they would just say that. Now, could it be something that got damaged somehow else? The guys didn't do it. But they think we... You know, they're going to think we did it anyway. You know, Sure. But, you know, if you're, you know, that, 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 that still kind of falls on us as a business. Because if, if I go to a house, like I went to a house one time and the dude's well was leaking. And before I weeded it or anything there, I took a picture of it. And I sent it to him. And I was like, hey, man, you got a, you got a pipe here leaking. Because I didn't want to, you know... I didn't want to be responsible for it. Um, I ended up trying to patch it up for him anyway, but I wasn't responsible. You know what I mean? I was just helping him out. So, yeah, I've been up here for two hours cutting on this yard. Boy, this thing was a mess. See if I get y'all a shot when we go by. Lawnmower's just sitting out there. I hope he ain't tore his lawnmower up. Just sitting there. Huh. Uh -huh. You shouldn't tear it up cutting that. I cut it before. It wasn't that overgrown though. Anyway, that's a whole. Not that'd be a whole nother video. We ain't gonna do that though. We gonna leave that alone. Um. Y'all know I want to say something, but I ain't. <laughs> uh, anyway, man, I'm getting back to the house. Uh, I had to go see a customer about some work I got to do in a lady's house, putting up some uh, some sun sunshades uh, in her house. I got them in about a week ago. I just ain't had time to go do it. Got a gutter I got to go put up over that porch I built. Got all kind of little ankle-biting projects I need to get done and get out of the way, so... Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close this video out here. Uh, hopefully in the next video, maybe I can do a follow-up on whatever, uh, you know, whatever it is with that flower pot or whatever it is. In fact, I may put some pictures in here if you send them to me in time before I do this video, I'll put them up. So anyway, hey. Appreciate y'all watching. My prayer for you is always the same, that the Lord might richly bless you and that you might see all of your blessings as from Him. Hope you have a great day.